What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Today is April 23rd, 2021. My birthday is in three days, so if you're planning on getting me a gift, go ahead and get to it. Um, today, I want to talk about the trials, the tribulations, and the pressure that we're all feeling and how that brings out the character of people. If you look around on social media, look to the news, there's more riots going on in more cities across the country. The border's still open, and we still have no real answers for any of the major questions we have. And it's beginning to show the cracks in the mental stability of the whole country. Now, in the book, The Art of Human or The Law of Human Nature by Robert Greene, he talks about the difference between rational and irrational people. And the way he explains it, the degree of separation is the key. Rational people will readily admit their irrational tendencies and their need to be vigilant. Irrational people become extremely emotional and confrontational when you question them or confront them about the emotional roots of their decisions. They are incapable of introspect or learning. Just look on social media and look on you and did you know that TikTok has apparently got this thing that's going to happen tomorrow which is sexual assault day challenge rape day this should tell you all you need to know and be careful with these people that you're following on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, whatever because always remember that Jesus told you to beware of false prophets who come to you as sheep, but inwardly are ravenous wolves. Men do not pick grapes from thorn bushes, nor figs from thistles. You will know them by their fruit. A good tree cannot bear bad fruit. A bad tree cannot bear good fruit. If a tree does not bear good fruit, it is cut down and cast into the fire. A good man with a good heart will bring out treasures that are good. And an evil man in his evil heart will bring out evil. It's all about the heart, guys. And with this pressure that we're being put under right now, it's developing character. Do you like the character you see? Proverbs tells us that water, like water, reflects a man's face. A man's life reflects his heart. All I'm telling you is, guys, you need to check your heart. And if you plan on participating in the 24th challenge for TikTok, I pray that whether you want to call it karma, I like to call it God, but I pray that God enacts justice swiftly on you. Yes, I do. I, I hope if you even remotely think about jumping in on that challenge, I, I honestly, I, I, hope, I hope your wiener shrivels up and falls off. I'm just saying it. I hope you have to walk around going, I don't know what happened. I was just walking around and just fell off. I hope that's what you have happened to you. And not even just for participating, but just for entertaining the idea of participating. There's no excuse for it. And there's no excuse for people to even be <laughs> remotely and on this so guys please understand that all the stuff the pressure that's going on don't get discouraged in it just understand this is going to show your character and how you deal with all this my question to you are you okay with your character and if you're not change it it's that simple love you guys talk to y'all soon